There's a storm coming, Ari. Just like last time. Daniel Radcliffe is all grown up for the fifth installment of the Harry Potter series, The Order of the Phoenix, and director David Yates is giving the teenage heartthrob full reign to show a range of emotions from crying to kissing. Daniel says getting physical with Gary Oldman, who plays Sirius Black on a very emotional scene, helped to open the floodgates. He said to me in his death scene, he, he said, uh, you know, We've been we're doing a few takes and we've been going at it for about you know two hours. We've probably been doing the scene and then he said to me, "Dan, do you mind if I, I sort of uh, I do something a, like, a little bit more physical with you this time?" And I sort of said, um, "Yeah, fine." Thinking maybe he's going to give me a hug or something like that. And um, but but actually he took me by the shoulders and shook me incredibly hard um, for about thirty seconds and shouted at me and. Um, and it's a bizarre phenomenon is that you sort of regress very quickly in this childlike state. And I just started sort of crying, which was bizarre. And, uh, and so he knew that he, he could do that. And, and, he, and he did, and it, I think it really worked. <laughs> what also works is the much anticipated kissing scene between Harry and Cho Chang, played by Katie Long, which took about 30 takes before they got it right. A lot of attention has been given to that scene, and rightly so. It's a, it's a scene that's been greatly anticipated for a few years now. The hysterical thing was that when we did this, this press junket for the fourth Harry Potter film, everybody was saying, so you have your first kiss in this film. And I was like, well, no, no, I don't actually. That, that's the next one. And people were very disappointed. So this year, their, their hopes will not go unfulfilled. Harry Potter and the Order of the Phoenix opens Wednesday in theaters nationwide.